Okay, let's give you guys some practice now. So you've got two similar circles here. Um, this one is 26 degrees. This one here is pi over 7 radians. The 26 degrees is roughly, roughly uh, pi over 7 radians. Well, anyway, find out. Um, what, so, so you've got two sets here. You've got to, you've working on on this side here. You're working in in uh, degrees. Okay, on this side here, you're working radians. Um, so, so here you've got 26 degrees. Work out this length here. Work out this length here. Okay, and and also work out uh, work out the area here. Okay, so. So, oh, by the way, this here, it has a radius of r, it has a radius of r here. So what, what is the formula for the, for this length here? And also, what is the formula for the area of this thing here? And also, um, so, so you've got to do it for degrees on this side, and then on this side here, you, you've got to work out this length, but that, but then you, you've got to work in radians here, and then also you've got to work out the, uh, the area here. Okay, and bear in mind, bear in mind that uh, the radius here is r, and the radius here is also r. Okay, so um, yeah, so press pause and have a go. Remember, work out the work out the length here on this side in degrees, and also the area, and then on this side here, you've got to work in radians, and then uh, work out this length here and also the area here. Okay, so um, so press pause and have a go. Okay, so um, to do this, here, well, in degrees here, um, work out work out the air, work work out the uh, the length of the whole circumference. So um, so get the whole circumference, which is two pi r, cut it up into three hundred and um, and sixty pieces, uh, equal pieces, and then um, and then get uh, twenty six pieces. So this here represents the uh, the length, this length here. Okay. Well, in radians, um, we'll work out the whole circumference first, which is two pi r, and then uh, and then cut up into into two pi uh, pieces. Okay, because from here to here is pi, and then from from here all the way around here is two pi. Well, just cut up, uh, just divide it into two pi um, equal pieces, whatever that means, and then and then get. This uh, this many pieces here. Even though it's less than, even though it's less than one, it still works. Um, uh, so so suppose you have something like this. Suppose you have twenty five point three uh, pieces. You, you you still times twenty five point three, and it will still work. Even if you have, um, even if you have an amount that's not a whole piece, it will still work. Um, for example, even if you have 0 0.3 of a degree, so you just times by, by 0 0.3 and it will still work. Here you've got something that's less than one radian, but who cares, it, it will still work. So so basically, get the whole circumference, cut out, divide it into two pi equal pieces, and then and then just times this amount here. So this here will give you will give you um, the, the the length here. And it's just now. It's just a matter of tidying this up. This one here would be um, would be uh, would be forty fifty two uh, fifty two pi r over three hundred and sixty three hundred and sixty here. And then uh, yeah, okay. And then on this one here, on this side here, it will be well top times top, bottom times bottom here. Um, so it will be two pi R and then you times pi again, uh, and then uh, and then here you've got two pi times seven. Well, these two here, they're they're going to kill off each other. So uh, on this side, it will simply be um, pi r over seven. That here would, would give you um, would give you the length here. Would give you the length here, and then on on this one here. Um, yeah, sorry. Uh, on um, on on this side here, it will be well even number, even number. So you know you can divide top and bottom here by by two. So this one here will be twenty six uh, pi r, and this one here will be one hundred and eighty. Even, even. So let's divide it again. Divide top and bottom here by by two. So this would be uh, thirteen pi r. 
over um, over 90 here. Okay, and uh, yeah, uh, so 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 the whole length here is this, and um, the whole length here is this. Uh, this is slightly well, well the, um, the the length is given by this. Okay, now to work out the area. Hang on. To work out the area now, so so to work out the area, first work out the whole area, and then cut up into 360, um, sort of cut cut up into 360 equal pieces, and then get 26 pieces. Okay, so so on this side the area would be um, would be pi r squared, cut up into 360 equal pieces, and then get 26 pieces. Okay, so so this the area of this segment here is given by by this here. Okay, on this side here, um, work out the whole area, which is um, which is pi r squared. Um, divided in what well, divided into two two pi equal pieces, and then get um, get this many uh, piece pieces or pieces. It's going to be less than one. Okay, so. Um, so it would be this on this side here. Well, uh, I, I can count, I can kill this one off. I can kill this one off. So it would, it would be pi r squared. Remember, top times top over 14. Okay. So this here is your answer here. On this side here, um, it gets multiplied to the top. So it would be 26 um, pi r squared over 360 even. Even so, let's let's divide top and bottom by two. So this would be um, thirteen uh, pi r squared over one hundred and eighty. So um, the the so hang on. So the area of this segment here, okay, is given by by this, and uh, and the area of this segment here, the area of this segment here. Is given by is given by this, okay? So yeah, okay. So that's your answer here. Uh, in degrees, the we are talking about the area now. In degrees, is this? In radians, is this? Okay.